Hi Virgo, this is your behind the scenes reading for November 2021. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for November 2021. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for November 2021. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for November 2021. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Virgo. Virgo, these are your cards, honey. So, Virgo, you have the Eight of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. This is you detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. So Virgo, listen, you're telling me that you're walking away, detaching emotionally here. But when we're dealing with the Eight of Cups, this is someone who's leaving in search of their Nine of Cups, their wish fulfillment. And oftentimes they find that the grass is not greener on the other side, so they end up returning. So Virgo, yes, you can be walking away, leaving, detaching emotionally. You could be returning or someone who left may want to return. Clarify the Eight of Cups for Virgo. Clarify the Eight of Cups for Virgo. Clarify the Eight of Cups for Virgo. It is clarified with you, Virgo, the Hermit. So right now you're taking some time out to be alone, to do some soul searching, introspection, searching your inner man for wisdom and guidance, going within, looking for answers. So Virgo, this is you. Clarify the Hermit for Virgo. Clarify the Hermit for Virgo. What about Virgo? What about Virgo? Clarify the Hermit for Virgo. It is clarified with the Page of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is news or a message about a passionate, creative new endeavor. Now, this can be the news about the spark of a new idea. The news, a message about some type of passionate action that needs to take place. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So passionate messages or news of passion. So Virgo, listen. You're telling me that either you guys had a heated discussion or argument here, okay? And there was a walking away leaving, okay? You can tell me that you found passionate messages and heard the news of them sharing passion or they could have found passionate messages concerning you, okay? But Virgo, you guys could also be, well, one of you guys can be sending the other passionate messages because they're wanting to come back. Baby, can I come back? Baby, come back. That's how it goes. Any kind of fool could see. And I, I'm lost without you. I don't know the words. Baby, come back. <laughs> Listen, clarify the page of wands for Virgo. Clarify the page of wands for Virgo. Clarify the page of wands for Virgo. It is clarified with the nine of wands. Uh-uh. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is you being guarded and standing your ground. You have a stance. You meant what you said. You said what you meant. You're not willing to bend, concede, meet halfway, eye to eye, or anything. But this is also a card of you saying, you know what? I'm tired. I'm wounded. I'm down for the count. But I still have a little fight in me left. I'm not giving up. Being persistent. But this is also a card of you having your walls up, your guards up. You're not trusting. A little suspicious, a little little paranoid here. So Virgo, listen, either this person is reaching out to you. Okay, first of all, let me just say this. 
This person could be reaching out to you with passionate messages and you're saying, uh-uh, I don't trust it. No way, no how. Mm -mm, I'm done. I left the situation alone. I'm done. Virgo, listen, you can tell me that you were the one who left, but you're wanting to return here and maybe reaching out to them with passionate messages here and going to be persistent because you want to return. Virgo, you can tell me that you found passionate messages and heard the news of someone sharing passion. You knew it all along. You were highly suspicious of this person, and so you're leaving. Virgo, you have the Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This queen is a no-nonsense type of queen. She already knows the truth. She'll let you speak your truth to bring more clarity, but she has no problems with cutting people, places, and things out of her life that no longer serve her. So Virgo could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or someone with air prominent in their charts. However, you could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Swords and cutting something out. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Virgo. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Virgo. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Virgo. Seven of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is someone lying, cheating, stealing, being manipulative, trying to get away with something, someone being deceptive, someone strategically devising a plan of action, someone being sneaky, trying to escape, trying to get away with something. So Virgo, there's been some type of lying, cheating, deceptiveness here, and this is the reason why you're cutting them off and leaving the situation here you don't trust. Virgo, you can also tell me that you're cutting and running. Are you leaving? Virgo, you have the King of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This king is a very charming, charismatic character. Someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go-getter, a take charge type of energy. Someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. However, you could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who initiates, who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or you're wanting to take action. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. It is clarified with the Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is news or a message about a solid, stable, committed offer. Now, this can be the news about an offer for an invite out for dinner in a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift anything of value. This is the news or message of it. So Virgo, some type of news about money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date. Could be some type of sneakiness here, okay? Or a commitment. Clarify the page of pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the page of pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the page of pentacles for Virgo. It is clarified with the three of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is heartbreak. This is pain. This is suffering. This is agony caused by a third party situation. So when I say third party, yes, a romantic third party. But this could also be meddling family members, friends, co-workers, neighbors, anyone being involved in you guys' relationship that shouldn't be that is causing you heartbreak. So Virgo, listen, either you're hurt because it's something going on with the finances here, maybe some type of theft or sneakiness here, Virgo. Virgo, you're either hurt because it could have been a third party accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or you're telling me that you're hurt here because, yes, there was a third party and it affects you guys' commitment. Virgo, you have the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting your wish, being divinely guided, following your destiny. So Virgo, listen, you can tell me that you're getting your wish somehow. You can tell me that you're following your destiny. However, you can tell me that you're needing to heal individually on your own, Virgo. However, you could be holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, and work things out. Clarify the star for Virgo. The star is also a travel card. 
clarify the star for Virgo. Clarify the star for Virgo. It is clarified with the Eight of Cups again. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. This is you detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. So Virgo, it looks like you're wanting to leave, walk away, detach emotionally here so that you can heal individually on your own. Could also be leaving, following your destiny, maybe going somewhere at a distance, okay? Could be some type of travel. Virgo, you have the wheel of fortune. This is the divine timing at play. This is the karmic wheel of destiny. This is a faded event. This is change in your luck and fortune. Where well, this wheel can spin and you can have good luck and fortune. Or this wheel can spin the other way and things can get a little rocky for you. So Virgo, you're telling me that everything has changed here. Could actually be a change in your luck and fortune. Or this is about divine timing. Clarify the wheel of fortune for Virgo. Clarify the wheel of fortune for Virgo. Clarify the wheel of fortune for Virgo. It is clarified with the eight of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is you feeling stuck. Like you're in a self-imposed prison of your thoughts. This is you feeling like you can't move, but you can move because it's all mental. This is you refusing to see some things, refusing to acknowledge some things, a lack of information, block communication. This is you feeling stuck, trapped, and blocked. So Virgo, listen, you can tell me that everything has changed between you guys. You block communication. Virgo, remember when I said it could be about some type of money here? changing your actual luck and fortune and i don't know maybe you want to put someone in jail here okay or maybe you're feeling stuck because it's, it has been a change in your luck and fortune and you're wanting to leave you're wanting to get away here virgo this is your behind the scenes reading for november 2021 you guys give me feedback subscribe like comment and share and i'll see you guys next week peace